morning I wake up to go uh, early morning flight, like one of those like 6 a.m. flights. So it's 4.30 in the morning and I don't want to travel today. I have a light headache. I didn't want to go. I call an Uber. The guy pulls up. It's snowy and it's icy and it's rainy and I'm pulling my thing down the stairs like this, trying that thing, and he opens the trunk and I set it in and close it. Guys, I have a hoodie on. I don't want to talk to anybody. I actually just wanted to take a nap or maybe like just work or something, you know, as we drove. We get in the car and just to be courteous, I said to the gentleman that's driving, I said, how are you? He turns back and he goes, if I was any better, my name would be Justin. I was like, no way. I like kind of look up. I was like, now I'm all about enthusiasm and I'm all about passion, but I was like, is this a candid camera? Is this a real for reals? I was like, okay. I said, what got you into driving for Uber? He said, well, my cats, they don't meow, they roar. And so in the morning, they wake up at 5 a.m. They start roaring. I think, well, look, got to feed the cats. So I feed the cats and it's 5.30. I don't even have work till 8. So I just drive for Uber. It's like, it makes a lot of sense. Okay. I said, so what do you do for work at 8? He's the co-founder of an $87 million tech company in Provo, Utah. This Uber driver is a multi, 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 multi millionaire whose cats don't meow. They roar, so he drives for Uber in the morning. Sometimes, my friends, you don't recognize the true identity of the person sitting right next to you.